Good evening, I am Scipio, the Cardboard Gambler, and I got off of work and found a Pokemon Celebrations, found an ETB, um, GameStop had a bunch of them, and I just walked right in and got one, and then they also gave me a Snorlax Jumbo promo card, and I'm assuming that this is the exact same art, maybe, I don't know what this, what is behind it. But I'm probably gonna pop it open to find out eventually. And then I also got this binder for free. Um, Jumbo binder. The Zacian and a Zamazenta in the back and then the Sword and Shield base set starters. So that is enough of the talking. This is my first time getting into celebrations. Um, I wanted to open this house so I could get the video out. I know everybody and their mother that is um, open in celebrations now and it's really nice to be able to get it um, at anywhere close to MSRP so I'm just gonna flip through this really quickly I'm sure a lot of people have seen what's inside just straight up fire the golden Mew is the card I want the most um, as far as like getting graded and stuff like that and this is a set that I will be completing so I'm actually very thankful that it's a small set so here we go open her up um, I don't even know if there's like promos. I've seen a couple of people open them, but let's see, I got some white dice made in China. And we get some dividers. Oh, I got the uh, Gold Star Greninja. Pretty sweet looking card. Already like super curled. And the same old counters. Energy pack. It looks kind of smaller than normal. Maybe it just looks small. Doesn't look like 45 energies. And I got the ETB. Good luck. Oh, and I got sleeves. Sweet, sweet sleeves. When I collect the sets, I like to put them in um, the sleeves that uh, come with it. With that set. And then we get uh, packy packs. So we get, let's see, four, five, seven, eight, nine so i got nine yeah so i get nine celebration packs and then looks like five uh regular packs i think i gotta work on my count no ten yeah i need to learn how to count so i got ten generations and then so you get 15 packs it's a pretty good deal so i'm gonna open these up save the, the uh celebrations for luck I'm completing the set, so I basically need everything. So we'll start off with Darkness of Blaze. Let's see if I can get another Charizard. Maybe. <laughs> or let's see if I can actually get one on camera. There we go, Cody Code. And on to the second pack of Darkness of Blaze. Not seeing anything awesome. There's a Decidueye. I think Champion's Path had the exact same Decidueye. So it looks like I struck out with DA. And I got some uh, Chilling Pain. I really, really want the uh, Moltres. That alternate art Moltres is an absolute beautiful, beautiful card. I think it's the only thing left that I really want out of that set. So it looks like Chilling Rain didn't offer up any goodies. And paddle styles. I like to say Vivid Voltage. I really like that set. Vivid Voltage is definitely my favorite sword and shield air set. So, looks like these regular packs are... Hopefully the uh, celebration packs are going to have something awesome because I am striking out. So, last of the regular packs, Vivid Voltage. See if I can get that uh, Rainbow Pikachu. That would be uh, ridiculous. But these are like so cold, I'm not sure. So here we go, no amazing rare, and no awesome rare. So <laughs> this opening is starting off definitely, definitely sad. So hopefully, I have seen a lot of people open these celebrations. The pull rates have been absolutely amazing. So let's see what happens. So my first ever pack, let's go Yvettel. Got the Kyogre, which is pretty cool. I uh, got the Claydol. 
Um, this is not one I've seen a lot of people pull and looks like the whole card has a like a hollow pattern on it and a professor's research and there is a Cody code so my first hit I'm gonna call the clay doll a hit all right so pack two we got the restaurant which I really enjoy this art Gordon Cosmog and Zacian, one of my favorite Pokemon. Not a huge fan of the art, <coughs> excuse me, and I don't like how that expansion symbol is so big, but uh, I will count that as a hit. So I got the Clay Doll and the Zacian V. Here we go. So another caught double tap on the Cosmog. Got the Lugia, looks like a bunch of like dirt, like a stain almost. And Gordon again. There's gonna be a lot of duplicates, so Sogaleo. It's such a uh, small set. There's gonna be a lot of duplicates. Yeah, 25 cards base, 25 cards um, with the subset. So Lugia, hoping to get that Charizard or like the Gold Mew. I guess I need them all. So Palkia is new. Pretty sweet. Ooh, and I got the full art Pikachu. There we go. Really, really sweet looking card. Again, with, the, with this time they put it on the left. I guess this is my first time noticing it. But there we go. Full art Pika. Reminds me of uh, the full arts in uh, Cosmic Eclipse. I'm halfway done with the celebration packs. Got the Gordon. Really sweet. Another Kyogre. Ooh, and birthday Pikachu. There we go. There we go. That's sweet with the Sogaleo. So yeah, these things are definitely got a lot of fire in them. So let's see, I got five packs left. So halfway through, I haven't gotten a double banger pack, but I got some goodies. So here we go, Palkia. I see something awesome in the back. This next card is going to be awesome. So my first Ho-Ho, and I see something super shiny. Ooh, Mew EX. There we go. I think I seen Pogo Dad pull this one. I was jealous. I was super jelly. There we go. That's a sweet looking card. There we go. And a uh, Lunalia. So it's my first time pulling uh, that with a mean print line going down it. So there we go. I'm getting some bangers getting some fire but from what I've seen the pull rates are like exceptional so here we go Refran, Lugia, Cosmog, ooh, and Surfing Pikachu which is a promo I'm not a big fan of the Surfing Pikachu's but I, I like the idea of it I think it's neat so it looks like this was the Pikachu box. I got the birthday Pikachu, the full art Pikachu, and a surfing Pikachu. Jeez. I got the Pikachu box. So Kyogre, Cosmog, Dialga. Oh, I got something. And a flying Pikachu VMAX. Yeah, so I did get the Pikachu ETB. So there we go. There's a big old jumbo jet. I think these are promos. I think you, if you buy like the, the VMAX box, I think you just get them anyways. Or I'm, I'm wondering if it has like the promo on the bottom. Like if it says the word, like if it's a Black Star promo. So I definitely got the Pikachu ETB. So Dialga, ooh, Zekrom, and ooh, Perfect. Venusaur. There we go. Always a good day when you pull an OG starter. So I got the Venusaur, some pretty good uh, centering on it. And it's got like shininess here. I don't know if the camera can pick it up. But there we go. This uh, was definitely, I would say like really good. So last pack, I'm not really expecting anything else. But uh, I'd say pretty much every pack had something awesome in it. So Cosmog. Oh, I'm gonna have some last pack magic, I think. Yvettel. Ooh. And Zekrom. Wow. 
Wow, this was a really good. It's, it's really hard to see the art on this card, but there we go. There we go. Definitely got some last pack magic. So the packs that the regular uh, expansion packs that came with it were kind of not so great, but I definitely feel like these celebration packs more than made up for it. This is, I would say this is pretty good. I have no idea about values. I'm pretty sure everything's going to crash and burn <laughs> as people mo open more and more product. But thank you so much for watching. And until next time, bye for now.